Hi guys, so today it's time to follow up the unboxing video of this Ultra Series Rolling Mill by Pepe Tools, this time with a proper review and a little project that will show you how this tool works. The mill was kindly sent to me by Pepe Tools USA, but of course all opinions are my own and the review is based on my personal experience with this tool. Okay, so let's start by learning a bit more about the tool itself. This mill is a combination rolling mill in size 110 mm. Combination means that there is a flat area and grooved area for making wires where you can make half round wires for ring shanks and square wires. 110 mm is the total size of the rollers in this rolling mill. The flat area is 57 mm and maximum opening between rollers is 5 mm. Millimeters. This machine is being manufactured by Pepe Tools in the USA. Interesting fact is that the frame of the mill is a one-piece solid construction. It's been specifically designed this way, so the mill will last you a lifetime, possibly longer. The top gears are used to adjust the height of the rollers, and this bar or handle is used to turn these gears and therefore lift or lower the top roller. You should have enough space to turn the handle comfortably. Now, one of the most exciting parts personally to me is the embossing and this is the technique that I will be using in today's project. The mill allows you to emboss almost everything on the metal to create unique, exciting patterns. It can be a fabric, paper cutout, wire, plants, you name it. Now I will start the project and I will share my final thoughts and review after the project's finished. Enjoy watching!
Right from the very first look, the mill seems very sturdy and solid and it's obvious that it will last for years with the proper maintenance. It comes with clear setup and care instructions and all company's contact details are listed for you to get in touch if you need any assistance. Using and adjusting the tool is also very simple and easy to understand even without instructions. My overall experience so far is very good and as you can see, the tool allows me to explore new ideas and designs and gain new skills. I haven't purchased any other rolling mills before, but from my research, it looks like Pepe Tools Mill is reasonably priced for the quality they offer. You can also choose from the range of sizes and types, which gives you flexibility. There are flat and combination mills and more advanced electric ones. Remember to protect your rollers from moisture. Even a little bit can cause them to rust, so dry your metal carefully each time after pickling before you work with the rolling mill. And it's best to use dried plants, as you can see in the video. I did try once with the fresh ones, but the effect was far from what I expected. They were completely squished and gooey and no print was left on the metal. So definitely something's dry. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video and as always comment below anything you'd like to know about the rolling mill and visit PayPay Pay Tools website to find out more about the tools they produce and get in touch if you have any questions. Right, thanks so much for watching and I will see you again soon. Bye!